Thank you, David. And yes, the middleweight division um, is is the hottest division in boxing now, and um, we we are very very excited to be showcasing uh, Toriano Johnson and uh, and David Lemieux uh, on this uh, on this spectacular card. So before I get to the uh, main event, I, I have to um, I have to acknowledge and and let our co-promoter know that what a wonderful job Eddie Hearn has been doing um, uh, with the zone, with promoting uh, 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 by far the best heavyweight um, in our sport today, and Anthony Joshua. Um, he is uh, the best promoter in the UK, and uh, he's come down uh, to conquer America, and, uh, and we are here working as partners uh, to conquer boxing for the better, to make sure that uh, that the fans uh, are get, not only getting their money's worth, but uh, but that the fans are. are we want to make sure that they don't uh, have to fork over their eighty dollars anymore uh, for a pay per view. So, um, without any further ado, uh, our co-promoter from Matchroom Boxing, Eddie Hearn. Eddie. Thank you, Oscar. It's a, it's a pleasure to work with you guys at Golden Boy, and I'm very excited about the partnership ahead. Not only are you great promoters, but you're also great dressers. I mean, I love that scarf you've got on. Bernard, that hat is on another level. I borrowed, my, I borrowed your polo neck this morning. I saw you with this one on yesterday. And I'd like to also thank Eric Gomez. Eric, where are you? Down there, thank you for everything. And particularly my friend Robert Diaz, who uh, we've worked with for a number of years now. And I'm excited to be linking up and using each other's shows to make sure that we can keep our fighters as active as possible. It's extremely important. You see so many great fighters in America who are fighting once a year, twice a year tops. It's not good for their profile, it's not good for their career, it's not good for their development. And on this show, we're lucky enough to have two of our special talents, one particularly in Katie Taylor six-time European champion, five-time world amateur champion, Olympic champion, and also now the unified lightweight champion of the world. She has huge support in Ireland and in America. And of course, Tevin Farmer, in my opinion, the number 130 pounder in world boxing, lighting up the place. If you read his story, it's incredible. Thrown in the deep end early on in his career, come through, now the most active world champion in boxing. He boxed in Boston in October, He's boxing this Saturday at Madison Square Gardens, and if he wins, we'll be taking him home to Philly in March as well. This is a fantastic card. And normally when you put a superstar of boxing on like Canelo, sometimes I've seen some of these American promoters have a little bit of a thin card. Not on Saturday. A couple of world championship fights, a great co-main event as well with Turiano Johnson against David Lemieux, Ryan Garcia, I'm a big fan. Brilliant, brilliant night of boxing. In here, Madison Square Gardens, the mecca of boxing. I want to thank Joel Fisher and the team, Sal as well at MSG, to think of the great fights that have been staged here in the past. Right in front of you there, Lamotta, Sugar Ray Robinson, Ali Frazier, one and two. So many great nights of boxing. It's an absolute honor to even be involved in a card here. Of course, we want to thank DAZN. You know, recently, we announced our 16-fight deal in the US with them. We've now expanded to Italy and Germany with them as well. This is a game changer for world boxing. Like Oscar said, normally US fight fans would need to put their hands in their pockets for $80, $100 this weekend. That's changing. It's free to watch this Saturday for Canelo against Rocky Field. And I applaud Golden Boy for taking that move, believing in the zone like we did as well. Not only is it a great deal for fans in terms of price, but the production is top draw. You've got Akin Barak, you've got Kay Adams over there, you've got Sergio Mora, you've got Sugar Ray Robinson, you've got Michael Buffer exclusive as well to DAZN. This really is a revolution of boxing and already since its launch in September we've produced over 10 world championship fights launching the service with, as Oscar said, the best heavyweight in world boxing, Anthony Joshua, and now you have the other biggest star in world boxing, Canelo. In my opinion, the two standout stars in world boxing in Anthony Joshua and Canelo Alvarez already part of the DAZN banner. It's very exciting times. On to the main event. This is a great, great story. I remember Eric Gomez phoning me up saying, would Rocky Fielding like to fight Canelo Alvarez? After I dropped the phone, I picked it back up and I phoned Rocky Fielding 
Not once did he ask about the money, not once did he once did he ask about the date. It was a yes, because this is what it's all about. This is everything to Rocky Fielding. This is the opportunity of a lifetime to come here to box in Madison Square Gardens and to defend his world title against Canelo Alvarez. One thing I promise you from Rocky Fielding is plenty of ability, plenty of heart, and a great fighting spirit and the will to win. And I believe he's going to give Canelo Alvarez absolutely everything he has and everything he can handle right here on Saturday night. So thank you to everyone. And right now, I'd like to introduce the trainer for Rocky Fielding, a guy who has taken him from strength to strength with the mastermind behind Rocky Fielding's great victory in Germany to win his world title. Ladies and gentlemen, Jamie Moore. Thanks, Ed. Thanks, everyone, for having us. It's um, an honour to be involved in such historical uh, event an iconic venue like Madison Square Garden. Um, I think boxing is all about timing, and Rocky Fielding made sure he was ready when he got the phone call for the world title at five weeks' notice. Um, he's a professional, he was fit, he was ready to set the opportunity, and it came at the right time for him. Um, he stayed busy, he stayed in the gym, even though we didn't have a date, and when we got the phone call for the, for the Canelo fight, he, he, he bit our hand off. He took it without hesitation. And there's weight divisions for a reason. And, uh, and, and you know, I applaud Canelo. I, I, I admire his, his, um, his tenacity and his, his will to, to, for greatness, to, to, to go to achieve greatness. But, you know, as I say, time, it's all about timing. And um, I just think that this is the right time for Rocky Field. And he's in, he's in a great place mentally and physically. And, um, and, and he's looking forward to, to shocking the world and putting in a big upset. Thank you. Thanks, Jamie. Uh, right now, um, he may appear in the promotion to this fight because of, obviously, the, the success and the size of Canelo Alvarez as the challenger. But one thing is for sure, he is the champion going into this fight, and he will div defend his belt with honour and pride on Saturday night. I'd like to call up to say a few words, the reigning WBA super middleweight champion of the world from Liverpool, Rocky Fielding. Thank you all. Um, thank you, Golden Boy Canelo, um, for the opportunity. And as they said, um, you know, I'm the world champion here. I've come over here as a world champion. It's, it's great to be here. You know, we as you're saying, the history behind it is unbelievable. Um, I was here three years ago. I was sitting right up the top there, watching the Knicks game, just dreaming one day to fight here. Um, three years down the line, I've put so much work in. I've had a lot of setbacks, but I've, I've kept positive. And here I am. I mean, my name's all around the arena. From, from sitting up the top to here is, is unbelievable, and I'm looking forward to it. Um, I went to Germany, no one gave me a chance in Germany, um, and I took it with both hands, I went over there and done a good job. Yeah, and the same year, no one's going to give me a chance here, but I prepared well, I believe in myself, yeah, I've come here as a champion, um, that's what champions do, they win and defend it wherever they, wherever they need to defend it, and, and this is a great opportunity and I'm really happy to be here, and I'm, I am grateful, so thank you for the support, and see you Saturday. Thank you very much, Rocky. So, in boxing, in boxing, you've had just a handful of master trainers. You know, trainers who, who teach you the art of boxing. You know, trainers who, who, uh, who teach you the fundamentals, but go beyond beyond tra uh, training you, um, you know, robotically. Throw the jab, throw the right, left hook, right hand. You know, the insides of, of, of knowing how to become a complete fighter. And I've been very fortunate in my career to have been trained by the great Emmanuel Stewart, 
uh, the great Gil Clancy, uh, the great Don Cholain Rivero, who trained me for Julio Cesar Chavez and other fights. So it is my pleasure to, to really give credit to this next young man who deserves, and he's on his way, deserves to be mentioned along these names at such a young age. Uh, Eri Reynoso has, has been a student of the game himself. What he's been teaching Canelo Alvarez, if you've, if, if you've seen his last fights, uh, the evolution that you've been witnessing over the years inside the ring has been, has been phenomenal. So let me introduce to you one of the, if not the best trainer today on the planet, that is Eddie Reynoso. Eddie. Eh, buenos días a todos. Good morning to everyone. Antes que nada, este agradecer a a Dizón por por introducirte al boxeo. Creo que es una gran oportunidad para todos los que estamos envueltos en él. Before anything, I want to say thank you to the zone for the interest in boxing and to thank everyone for being here. Al promotor de Rocky Fielding por aceptar también la pelea. I want to thank the promoter of Rocky Fielding for accepting the fight. Sabemos que es una pelea muy muy dura. Siempre que se sube de división o se baja, que realmente es experimentar cómo se siente el boxeador. We know that it's going to be a tough fight. Every time when a fighter moves up in weight, the fighter has to experiment how he's going to feel. Fielding es un peleador fuerte, un peleador que viene embalado y más que nada es un campeón mundial. Fielding is a strong fighter, he's a tough fighter, but more than anything, he's a world champion. Sabemos del compromiso que tenemos y como tal lo asumimos de, con responsabilidad. Hicimos una gran preparación, cuidamos we, todos los detalles. We know that the, we have a big compromise ahead of that and we've taken the responsibility to make sure all the details are good y for the fight. Y solo esperamos que el sábado, eh, pues, estar incluidos en los mexicanos en ganar tres campeonatos mundiales con Saúl. And I just hope that this Saturday the Mexicans are excited to have uh, Canelo become a three division world champion. Hemos trabajado bastante fuerte no para esta pelea sino para los 13 o 14 años que tenemos ya con Saúl y creo que el sábado vamos a a dar un paso importante para entrar al, a la elite del boxeo mexicano. We've worked hard, not just for this fight, but during the 13 or 14 years we've been here, and we're excited to have him join the exclusive history of Mexican boxing this Saturday. Muchas gracias y que disfruten la función que va a estar muy buena este sábado con grandes prospectos también en, en la cartelera. Muchísimas gracias. I hope you enjoy a great event this Saturday, which will also feature young prospects. Thank you. The next gentleman needs no introduction. Um, his name is uh, Ed, uh, Chepo Reynoso, who is the mastermind behind everything. He is a great manager, he's a friend to everybody. But again, like I said, he's a mastermind of everything. That is Chepo Reynoso, Chepo. Muy buenos días. Good morning to everyone. Un saludo a todos y cada uno de ustedes. We want to say a salutation to each and every one of you. Saludo a Nueva York. Salutations to New York. Hey, Madison Square Garden. Prepárate porque el Canelo viene a conquistarte. Madison Square Garden, be prepared because Canelo is coming to conquer you. Y a escribir en el libro de tu historia. And to write in the story of Madison Square Garden. Aquí triunfó el Canelo. Gracias. Here's who triumphed Canelo Alvarez right here. Muchas gracias, uh, Chepo. And now for the main attraction of the day, at the uh, tender age of 28, Canelo Alvarez became the face of boxing, um, having to 
win multiple world champions, uh, championships, going for his third division against a fighter who is much bigger than him, has a lot of experience, has the will to win, has the heart to win. But facing him in the mecca of boxing, Madison Square Garden, when I mentioned to Saul and when he mentioned to us that he wants to fight in New York, I mean, what better place than Madison Square Garden, where the greats have fought? Canelo Alvarez will, in the last 20 years, be the second Mexican national fighter next to Julio Cesar Chavez to fight um, in Madison Square Garden. So this is a big deal for his countrymen. This is a big deal for boxing and a big deal uh, for Saul Canelo Alvarez. It is my pleasure to introduce to you uh, the undisputed middleweight champion of the world from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, Saul Canelo Álvarez. Gracias. Muchas gracias. Primero que nada, quiero agradecerles a todos por estar aquí. Muchas thank gracias you very por much. su apoyo. Before anything, I want to say thank you for being here and thank you for your support. Eh, estoy muy contento de estar aquí en el Madison Square Garden. I'm very happy to be here at Madison Square Garden. Es un, es un sueño más realizado en, en mi carrera. It's just yet another story, another dream realized in my career. Y en esta nueva etapa con, con Dizón también eh, estoy muy contento, muy motivado. And this new phase in my career with the zone, I'm very happy and I'm motivated. Quizás muchos no le dan el crédito que, que se merece Rocky Fielding, pero por algo es campeón mundial. Perhaps many don't give the credit to Rocky Fielding that he deserves, but for a reason he's a world champion. Yo sé lo que es, sé el riesgo que tengo enfrente, me preparé muy, muy fuerte como siempre. I know who he is, I trained very hard, I know the challenge I have in front of me. Sé que va a ser una pelea fuerte el sábado. Pero me gustan los retos, estamos listos para hacer historia. I know that I have a tough fight, but I like the challenges and I know we're going to make history. I'm ready for that. Y espero que disfruten de una gran de una gran noche el sábado. Muchas gracias a todos. I hope that you all enjoy a great night this Saturday. Thank you to all of you. Muchas gracias. Thank you. Um, before I before we uh, pose the fighters for pictures, I just want to say uh, one thing that um, thank you. Thank you, HBO. Thank you, HBO, for all the memories. Thank you for uh, your platform, the opportunities. Over the years, you have been the pioneer, the one who have opened up the doors to all these great world champions and legends. But there's a new kid on the block, and his name is Dazone. So don't miss this fight Saturday night, December 15th, on Dazone. Thank you.